What if I told you that Elden Ring actually has a new version, basically, of the Black Knight's Halberd from Dark Souls 1 and 2? In this video, we're going to show you an amazing S-tier strength scaling Halberd that you need to get, and if you do enjoy these videos and find them helpful, make sure to click like and subscribe down below to support the channel, and comment if you have any other S-scaling weapons that you think are worth using and playing through the game with. I'm Paradise Central, so we're going to talk about the Knight's Rider Glaive. This is a jet black glaive with a blade as weighty as a bludgeon. The weapon is one of the knight's cavalry who ride the funeral steeds, and this glaive excels at weighty slash attacks that crash into foes, making it a powerful weapon even on horseback. But it has so much more uses than just fighting on horseback. You will need 26 strength and 10 dex for this. It has massive reach as it is a halberd. It has a really good move set, fast R1 attacks, a really good two-handed move set, and of course the running poke attack is absolutely awesome as well. So as far as the move set goes, it's definitely worth trying out if you haven't tried this halberd already. And this is before we've even got to the best bit about it. It comes with the weapon skill spinning slash, but can be infused with an ash of war, which means we can put anything we want on it, and it works really nicely with something like Sword Dance or even Flaming Strike. Sword Dance is particularly powerful and I definitely recommend trying that one out if you haven't tried it before with this Halberd with S scaling and strength with a strength build that Ash of War can do some real heavy damage. But the real excitement begins when we learn that obviously by changing Ash of War we can change the scaling of the weapon to any type that we want and for this weapon a lot of the different options actually B scaling in strength which is still decent and even has B scaling in dex for the lightning scale which is really rare for weapons outside of daggers so that is pretty cool. You could make this work for a dex lightning build if you wanted. However, for heavy, it does have S scaling in strength, which is incredible. Both fire and heavy scaling are great options. However, heavy scaling doesn't come with that innate fire damage, which means that we can also buff it with incantations. So you can use something like the blood flame blade to further boost the damage and also give it some bleed. So we've gone a bit over the scaling and some really good options. We've gone a bit over the Ashes of War and some really good options to pick there. But let me tell you guys, power stancing this weapon is incredible. You can do this if you're in New Game Plus, or if you use something like the Gargoyles Halberd as your offhand, you get the awesome power stance combo, but also an insane jump attack. These things together deal massive damage with jump attacks and make even higher health enemies die super fast and look like a bit of a joke. These halberds are actual heavy hitting monsters. And by using gear like the Raptor's Black Feathers, as well as the Claw Talisman, you can further boost those jump attacks to deal even more damage and kill most things in one, two, or three jumps. Another great thing is that to get S in scaling, you only have to take heavy up to plus 20. You don't even have to go to plus 25, which means you can save on your ancient smithing stones. Remember, if you choose to go for the fire scaling option, which is still really, really good, it will split the physical damage of the weapon with fire damage, but that does mean that buffs like Flame Grant Me Strength or the Fire Scorpion Charm will all feed into buffing your fire damage. And if you're going for something like Flame Strike as your Ash of War, then that fire damage bonus from those items is going to affect the fire damage on that as well, and it all feeds together to make a really synergetic build and weapon combo. So it has a really good moveset, a really good two-handed moveset, great reach, especially as a Halberd, it has a customizable Ash of War, it has multiple scaling options and different builds that you can lean this into to customize it to your personal playstyle, and it has insane power stance damage, especially for jump attacks. This is definitely a weapon that you should try if you haven't already. And you can get this for yourself, all you need to do is defeat the Knight's Cavalry that wanders near the road near the Bellum Church site of Grace in Leonia of the Lakes. If you plan to try this out for yourself, please let me know in the comments down below and let me know what you think of it once you've tried it, plus it up, put some points in strength, spec it heavy, buff it with an incantation, and go and do some power stance jump attacks and let me know in the comments. Do drop a like and subscribe to support the channel if you do enjoy these videos. And if you do enjoy them, the videos on screen now we think you will really enjoy, so definitely click them, don't miss out. We've made these videos for you and we hope you enjoy them.